we saw very pleasant weather for our day yesterday. We saw plenty of sunshine, but did notice that cloud cover slowly starting to build back up and even noticing a bit more as we start our day today. So good, good layer of those mid and upper level clouds thanks to high pressure off to our south. It's really not affecting us much, but the good news though, did see this warm front to push through yesterday that did allow our temperatures to get back into the 50s. We'll continue to warm up over the next couple of days, but as that low pressure moves on through, unfortunately, we will see pretty much any chance for precip of all types. So the good news though, Sunday chance has been completely dropped and even Friday's chance for tomorrow, likely just to the early morning hours, pretty much nothing through the rest of the day. Saturday though, that cold front moves on through, so very good chance we'll see some showers and even a second system that rolls on through Monday and Tuesday. Now much of that should be rain at least on Monday's end of things, but good chance we'll see some snowflakes trying to mix in as well, especially overnight into Tuesday morning. And as that cold front moves on through, could see a few lake effect snow showers, mainly for the morning hours on Wednesday. Just don't expect much of any in the way of accumulation. This morning though, most of us still holding on to the 30s. So just about 33 here in Wheeling with our warm spot of 34 in New Martinsville, but a couple spots now into the 20s like 29 to St. Mary's and our cool spot of 27 into Cambridge. So still a bit of frost out there this morning. So if you parked outside, give your car just a couple extra minutes to warm up and a frost. Definitely make sure you grab a coat or a jacket as you step out the door this morning. But like yesterday, the day itself really not looking that bad. Expect a little bit extra cloud cover. So partly cloudy throughout the day. So we see periods of sunshine. You see periods of clouds, but at least our temperatures are warmer. And we're noticing that this morning. So by nine into the 40s, even by noon, chance we could get into the low 50s, which means most of us should max out somewhere about 60 degrees this afternoon. So still a few of us in the 50s with our cool spot of 58 into Barnesville in Woodsfield, but as warm as 63 on down into St. Mary's. So cloud cover slowly builds back up, so it should allow our temperatures to finally get above freezing overnight tonight. But unfortunately, while it will be in the 40s, clouds and a few spotty showers likely return mainly once we get past mainly towards that midnight time frame. So by 6 p.m. this evening, really just seeing cloudy skies. And even by midnight, we see those showers trying to cross over I-70. Very spotty, very stray, even by 2 a.m. That's the best chance we actually see rain, but by the morning commute. Good chance the showers are out of the area and we should see decreasing clouds throughout the day tomorrow. So cloudy first thing, but we'll see the sunshine return for the afternoon and we'll continue to see our temperatures in the low 60s and we'll even stay that way through the weekend. Just unfortunately see those spotty and scattered rain chances for our day on Saturday. 48, a few extra pockets of sunshine for our day on Sunday before that mixed precip tries to return Monday and Tuesday. So 45 afternoon precip on Monday back to the 30s with a bit of mixed precip Tuesday morning. And then we could see a few lake effects, snow showers on Wednesday with temperatures in the 30s. Just don't expect much, if any, in the way of accumulation.